Hello, anybody out there? I know everybody is pretty busy because of the holiday. But I felt like coming live because I've been doing the dark videos because I wasn't feeling so well. I was in a lot of pain. Oh, Siri, go away. Okay. Um... I don't know if anybody's out there. Let me see if my friend is there. Let me give her my link. The link to my. What is the link to this video? Okay, let me go see how to share it. <coughs> I had done, just did that one uh, <coughs> blackened video and. It was on the uh, I is the uh, black black axe was that black axe uh, scammers and it was pretty eye opening. Oh, usually I don't come on this page for the Avon. I always go to the other page. Okay, well, um, well, let me get this from my friend first. Let me share it with her. I don't care, please. And I got new lighting. And I hope it's not too bright. <clears throat> and my nose is driving me nuts. As always. Where did my cough drops go? Well, I should take a cough drop. Oh. Okay. Cough drops ready. Let's see. And then my page. <laughs> I look so funny in my other videos. <clears throat> okay. Now I'm going to say we needed orders um, for my goal all year, which was to donate um, I needed orders all year to get up enough money donations to put it with any extra money that we had for uh, donations for like uh, uh, sock donations for the homeless and deodorant donations for the homeless. Well, this year, um, we, instead of doing the socks, because we didn't make enough orders, we only had one order, so that went to the deodorants. So we got up a bunch of deodorants, which was like, a, I don't know how much, close to a hundred, I'm not sure. I can't remember how many. It may have been a hundred deodorants. And then um, some uh, what do you call those things? Ooh, my English is so bad. Uh, what, what are they called? Um, hygiene kits. Okay. So I got deodorants in, from Avon and hygiene kits um, for that, which my sister, she'll be going to uh, drop those off, <clears throat> hopefully in a couple of days, to where they're going. So our goal of getting the socks, we didn't reach that goal because we only did one order. Uh, throughout all these months, actually. The only thing I've been doing is ordering to um, donate. <laughs> so, unfortunately, we didn't get to um, do our donation of the socks this year. Um, but we did get to donate some so far to the little girl, my Kendra, that um, 
I've been sharing her uh, PayPal and GoFundMe. I'll put that in the, uh, I'll edit that into this video. And, oh, I'm supposed to be getting that link from my friend. So we never made our goal for the socks, but we did over the whole year. I got up enough deodorants and hygiene kits for um, the homeless. Why can't I share this? Okay, let me go share it. Um, I can't share it in a private message. What Facebook is really messing with? Wow. Okay, I guess I'm just going to have to tag my friend in there. Oh, is it going to tag her? So, um, yeah, we were not able So all year long, I worked my rear end off trying to get up the best free chat ever. Yes, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Yay. Yay. You like my free chat this time. Yay. I got to get used to the camera. <laughs> Thank you. I'll keep making it like that then. Uh, whenever we have stuff like that to make it. When did you comment? Uh, okay. Um, let me go and find McKendra's hip hop right quick also. And um, my Kendra. Because I'm always worried about this little girl. She needs that surgery and <sighs> I've got chest pain. Cause I'm getting a little nervous on camera. I haven't been on for a while. Well, whatever. So let's see if I can find her PayPal. Um, I'm gonna pin her PayPal to the top the top of the comments. Uh oh. Wait. That's not it. Um, because uh, she she's still needing donations because um, man, the the hospital sent her home, and she's in bad shape. They sent her home like that, and it really upset me a lot. Unfortunately, they can't keep her because they need Medicaid to um, pay for her surgery. So we donated to her cause instead of uh, putting the money toward uh, the socks because we only, like I said, we only got one order for the Avon. So that money from the one order of Avon all year went to the um, deodorant donations. And then uh, we got hygiene kits for the homeless also. So 
Avon uh, deodorants and hygiene kits. So, and then, okay, I'm gonna pin this comment. So if any of you, oh, come on. Is it gonna let me pin it? Yes, all right, pin comment. So that is her um, link to her PayPal to um, help her out for, um, for all that coming up for her surgery. And I hope this is not too much light. The last time it wasn't enough light. So maybe if I lift it up here. Well, it won't stay up, so. Okay, there we go. Oh, that's good. Okay, so that's my kinder's journey. So I'm going to wait and see if anybody else comes in. Like, uh, maybe I should share the video, right? Let me share the video because I would like to ask um, people before I make my next order, which I have to make up my mind whether I'm going to make the order to sell it or make the order to donate it because we got we still have the winter, but. If I can get up enough orders for the Avon, if people will buy enough off of me, well, then that'll give us extra donation money to donate. I mean, all we're doing, all we've been doing is donating, donating, donating. Look, I will never be a rich person. Well, a lot of people beg to differ that I'm a rich person without being a rich person, but I'm like, I will never consider myself to be a rich person because practically all that I have, I just give it away. <laughs> like I have nothing of value. I really don't, except for a cell phone and a laminator. And the laptop ain't even mine. <laughs> I wish it was mine. I need one for myself. Okay, well, so anyway, back on the subject. So I need orders. The only thing is, is that I'm not selling Avon tonight at all. And the reason why I'm not selling Avon tonight at all is because I don't like Black Friday. I've never believed in Black Friday. I don't believe in all that culture crap and it has nothing to really do with my religion because come on Black Friday is some stupid stuff that somebody made up that's commercialistic and blah blah blah. Who knows where it came from? I, I don't even care. So <laughs> uh, my nose. Let me go and share this video right quick. And whoever is there, please comment. I saw Ali, but Ali is busy. He liked this fruit shot that I made. Okay, so let me share this video before I start talking some more. I was going to tell y'all where I got this stuff from. Uh. Okay, pay attention to what you're doing. Okay, I gotta pay attention to what I'm doing. I've been in here 12, 14 minutes already. Okay, wait. Let's see. Mm, sharing groups, groups. Um, let's. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Turkey. <laughs> Since Ali is over there killing turkeys somewhere. <laughs> oh, and I'm going to talk a little bit of scammers on here. So, well, Mm, yeah, I'm going to share it in my scammer group because I talk about scammers also. Okay, so there. Oh. That was not right. There we go. Ha ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 ha. Okay. Let's make sure you get all your groups. La -da -da -da. There we go. Mm -hmm. I always got to make sure I post in my page and not under my profile because oh, Facebook has a habit of kicking me off and That didn't even go with the message. Oh my God. Let's talk Avon donations. Scammers. <laughs> <sighs> My kindred journey. Okay, now I can share it. Uh, what really? Oh, man, you know what? I hate Facebook sometimes. I really do. It really ticks me off. It really does. It really ticks me off. So now I gotta go back to this and do it all over again. Say, oh, come on now. Okay. This be frustrating. You know what? I think before I come on live, I need to write down everything that I'm going to talk about because I'd be going in circles, round and round like crazy. All right. Sure, 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 sure. Now all Facebook will probably do is block me from sharing in my groups because people, can you believe I own all these groups, a whole almost a hundred groups, and people will complain about me posting in my own groups, guys. People are nuts. People be nuts. People be nuts. If you come in, please tell me you're there. Because I like the chit chat, even if it's not about anything that I put in the, in the, um, okay. All right, all right, all right. So, okay, so, anybody there? Just uh, comment and let me know if you're there. <laughs> Get situated, situated. Okay. So, I, all right. Uh, let me talk about the skimmer thing first. Um, the last scammer that I went up against was a pretty bad one, and I got some death threat, blah, blah, blah. Who cares? I'm like, I'm going to die anyway. I got one foot in the grave. Who cares? So I didn't know about the Black Axe. All I knew about was the 419. 
obviously there's something called a black axe and it's a group that came out from Nigeria and it's now in 26 countries and they are behind a lot of these romance scams and military romance scams and stuff like that and uh, they just the news cast for Canada just uploaded a video on it about um, a lady that uh, she got scammed out of like a million dollars for the military romance scam and you know when they're talking to these people that are behind these accounts and they're being scammed by these mi fake military accounts these fake guys what's wrong with my phone these fake guys in these military accounts are these uh, uh, guys that are romance skimming them, whatever? Um, they're not talking to only one person. And th they're talking to more than one person. And a lot of people don't understand this. A lot of the victims don't understand this. And it's sad. And unfortunately, they drove her to her death, to her suicide. And it's very unfortunate that the police did not uh, confiscate her laptop and her phone and go through it and help her sister out, you know. And so many times uh, her family did try to stop her from, you know, sending money and stuff. And they had the police take her and evaluate her and all kind of stuff. And... They just couldn't do nothing for her while she was alive. But at least they could have done something for her while she, after she died. You know, to bring these guys to justice instead of just letting them go on and do it to other people. And it's not only women that these men are doing it to. It's men also. Um... I'm going to say this. I am very concerned about someone right now. No, I don't know where he is out there in the world right now. But he's not my family. He's nothing but unfortunately he's been getting scammed over the last year or two something like that year i think and the last time i spoke with him he was about to sell his house he's a veteran and me and my cyber security guy rod crier of course i'm going to give him credit in all of my videos because he's been doing very good on my groups and if anybody has anything bad to say about hilly camp he's been very good to me and to my people on my group except for a couple of people but they were nuts so i had to get rid of them no they were nuts so <clears throat> he did tell me that he needed to go and have some surgeries done and i told him well when i came back from youngstown <clears throat> I told him when I came back from Youngstown, I would take him to get food because he had told me that he was in need of food and he was only going to the VA and a couple of pantries here and there, but it wasn't really anything that that I can do more for him. So I offered to take him on a food run. I got back from Youngstown and I messaged him and I called him and he didn't answer me and he hasn't messaged me back. So I let it go for a little while. I'm like, well, maybe he, you know, maybe he had a surgery or whatever. And then somebody told me that they had seen him 
one night and I was like, okay, well, he didn't go for his surgery yet and he hasn't called me back. He hasn't messaged me. So I don't know. I'm kind of thinking that if he's a, a, avoiding that person, then maybe he's trying to avoid me also because maybe he didn't believe me and my cybersecurity guy about him being scammed by the uh, Africans. <laughs> unfortunately and you know you can't save everybody but he's this little old man and i don't even know if he has any family or whatever but i mean all i can do is just try to call him again right i don't remember and i didn't write down when he's going to be going into the hospital for surgery or anything so um it is kind of weighing on my chest. But it's very unfortunate because I felt like a, a, a depression coming from him that night when I was explaining to him all about the um, African skimmers and what they do and that, and that we found out that the phone number that um, his supposed girlfriend was calling on was coming out from Africa and <clears throat> unfortunately the pictures that he had given to me were not they were of um, somebody else but not of somebody that he would that would be talking to him that he's actually been talking to men more than one man actually and not a woman So it's very, very upsetting, and um, hmm. it kind of hurts when you can't help them. <laughs> I don't want to get upset, but <clears throat> I'm okay. It just hurts when you can't help them. And I kind of felt like, you know, some depression coming off of him. And it's like, I don't want somebody else to commit suicide just because, you know, I told them that they're being scammed or whatever, you know. But also, this man had sent thousands, thousands of dollars to these idiot scammers and he's losing his house and he'll tell you that he's not losing his house because of the money that he has lost for sending it to his so-called girlfriend which turned out to be African scammers that he probably doesn't want to believe me but um Um, and my heart is kind of heavy on that right now. So I don't know. I really didn't know when he was going to go into surgery. So that's that. Otherwise, I do have um, the skimmer report group. Um, let me look that right up quick. Skimmer report group. A skimmer report two and facebook actually recently um gave us a couple of <clears throat> uh warnings that they're gonna shut our group down because me my um admin rod crier and myself had posted some um a couple of um what do you call it? profiles and you know on the profiles these <laughs> fucking they have like porn pics or whatever right so they have that as their profile and cover pics so when we put their when we put their link in the group then whatever comes down on that drop down thing for their link 
of course, it's going to show the nasty picture that they have as their profile or cover page. So, but just because of that, Facebook wants to penalize us as admins of the group. So then they say, well, if you keep posting like that, then we're going to just shut down your group. And I'm like, really? Whatever. So, um, oh, I need to, um, all right, I'm going to put this, the scammer report to group link in the comments, but I can make a, a list here. Let's see. I'll make a list and then I'll, um, okay. So I'm going to put my Kendra's, my Kendra, my Kendra's journey page link. What am, what am I doing? Oh, okay. What time is it? I think I'm going to stay on here until about 11. Explaining things. So if anybody just wants to come on and talk, maybe you've been scammed. Maybe you've been treated bad by an organization. Um, maybe you want to donate somewhere and you don't know where to donate. I got all kind of nice places to no donate. Um, if you want to order some Avon, but after Black Friday, that's fine with me. Just let me know. I'll set you up after Black Friday stuff in Cyber Monday, because I don't do Cyber Monday either. Well, maybe I can do Cyber Monday. I don't know. I'll have to think about it. All right, so this is my kindred journey page okay and then my kinder journey excuse me my kinder journey paypal I don't care anything I want to talk about. Just come talk to me, you know. Tell me how your day went. How was your holiday? This and that and the other. That's fine. Like, I got a lot of cleaning and cooking done. So that's why I have a little bit of time to jump on live. Okay. I can throw my Kendra's pay pal for oops for donating. Oh for donating. Okay. Then after that skimmer report group. Two. Scammer Report Two Group. Uh, Scammer. Man, my Kendra, she is so cute. Ah. Uh, Gosh, if you go see her live, the last live that they did, she is so cute, y'all. I feel so bad. Like, I just couldn't believe they sent her home like that without 
like at least admitting her or something like that or I don't know man. I just I was so upset at that. That's in her home. Oh my god, please tell me okay, yeah. Adding in Okay. All right, so and then Gifted More is my page. So if you want to go look at it, see what I have to offer for the Avon, and you want to order after after Black Friday, you can order after Black Friday. <laughs> oh, my page reached a hundred likes. Do I have the a shout now button? Let's see. I thought I had Yeah, it does go. Okay, so if you Hey Stacy, wait a minute. Which posts did you react to? This chick Okay, so is this my page? Yeah, this is my page for Adnan's Gifts and More. You can go and do the Shop Now button, but please do not go to the Shop Now. Well, if you want to go to the Shop Now button and see what we have to offer after Black Friday, that will be fine with me. Oops. All right. <clears throat> so uh page hey. and This uh, the um, the thing is really hard to edit. Okay. Um, I was in a little bit of pain, yo. Okay, let me see. Yeah. I didn't even sleep since yesterday. I just forgot about that. All right, so we can talk about anything on this live if y'all come. Hello. All right. Let me edit this video now. Somebody's watching. Is that you, Stacy? Hello. Hello, Stacy. Are you there? You know what? I can't even see who's who's in my live or nothing anymore. You know, like, <laughs> who's doing hard? Oh my God, okay, who's watching? Hi, where's the comments? Y'all commenting? Wait, <laughs> Stacey, you just, I, <laughs> I see you, I see you. Um, yeah. Okay, so I'm just discussing a lot of different stuff, like on the donations and my Kendra Journey page. You know, she's going to have the surgery. And then 
Um, I'm trying to get orders up for Avon, but I need to know what products people want to buy. But after um, Black Friday, because you know I don't do Black Friday. I don't do the holidays. I don't do Black Friday. I don't care about Black Friday. But it's just I, I got my Avon paid up. So, well, I'm going to get it paid up. And then I have to make an order. So I want to know if people are going to want to buy. And if nobody wants to buy, then I need to go ahead and just do donations. Because I use the business pretty much for helping people than I do for business. Because, well, since you're here, Stacy, you already knew when I was doing the business, it was kind of hard for me to keep up because of my health. So I only do Avon for donations and donating. Yeah. Oh, I gotta check the comments. Oh my God, why is it not showing me the comments? We're like, really y'all? Oh, it's not showing. Oh, hey, Gigi, hey, oh, hey. Happy Turkey Day. Okay, happy Turkey Day to everybody also. Remember, Adnan is over there somewhere killing turkeys. <laughs> this man said, why did the turkey cross the road? And I'm like, man, oh. Okay, why did the turkey cross the road? Because it's Thanksgiving. I'm like, get out of here. <sighs> get out of here, leave, go. <sighs> The turkey crossed the road because it's Thanksgiving. Okay, let me check the comments, y'all. Hey, Gigi. <laughs> Jeannie, Jeannie, Jean, Gigi. Oh, oh. Okay, let me check the comments right quick because this is... It won't let me see the comments on here anymore. Hey, Leslie, how you doing? Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> a little bit in pain, but I'm all right. I think I'll make it on here until 11 o'clock. How you doing? I saw a post. I think you just posted that as a joke, right? Angie, I don't know if you're watching me. Did I post? Wait a minute. Let me see if I shared this on my page. <laughs> I mean, on my profile, actually. Oh my God, y'all, where's my life? <laughs> okay, let me check all the comments. This is fun. I mean, on my profile, actually. Okay, that's not gonna give it to me. Oh, there it is. Oh my God, y'all, where's my life? About to drive, I'll see if you're still live when I get home. Okay, see you still. Okay, yeah, you go ahead. I saw the comment now. Okay. Okay, yeah, go ahead and drive, and uh, yeah, I'll see you later. I, I'm going to try to stay on here until 11. Uh, I'm going to try to stay on here until 11. <laughs> That's if anybody wants to come and talk, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to be like, come chat. <laughs> All right, so next I'm going to go on the Avon site and see if see what they have new. I, I don't know what they have new, and I don't know what everybody would like. Okay, so deodorants is... I mean, if you guys buy deodorants at the store, mine are just a little bit higher, but you know what, Imari? That will knock out any perspiration anybody has. And then the Mesmerize for Men. Let me show this to my... Uh, Mesmerize for Men. And... Uh, Perceive for men. Oh, wait. Do we have perceive? 
I don't know if <laughs> I need to check because you know that every once in a while, every once in a while they're getting rid of stuff, so I have to check. I hope I make it until 11. Haha, -ha, here I can see all of the comments. Yay! All right. Yes, I said hi. Happy Turkey Day. <laughs> oh, wait. What the heck? <laughs> okay, so I like that one twice. All right, let's see. Thank you for watching my video, Gigi, but it's going to be a pretty long video, and you probably ain't got time to, like, sit here and, like, eh, chat all night. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. So, um, I'm going to go to my, oops. Let me go to my website. And see what we go out. See, I don't like the Black Friday, Friday stuff offers. So I'm going to look at sales and specials on every other day. Come on. Ooh. Ah, uh, no one knee. Oh. Sales and specials. Why is it not going? Okay, I'm going to put my link in the... Wait a minute. I'm going to put my link in the um, comments for if you guys want to, um, oh, if you guys want to um, join me on the website, we have holiday stuff. Well, holidays, oh, you know what? We got gifts under ten dollars. Let's see what the gifts under ten dollars is. Um, sort by price. Okay, sort by price. So we have a bunch of little stuff like um, uh, the holiday lip balm. The Merry Moments Emery Board. You know what? They sold those all year. They never sold out of them. Little cutie holiday Emery Boards. Then we have the um, all the the um, special little hand creams. We got Cheers to You Champagne Shower Gel. Avon Sparkle Vanilla Champagne Shower Gel. Wait a minute, those aren't on sale. What the heck? Okay, this vanilla champagne hand cream, it is $2.50, and I'll tell you what, it's worth it. If y'all need some nice hand cream, that is some good stuff. I mean, all this other stuff is on sale too. Like, um, oh, I can't remember which one is the best one for the hand cream. Um, Vitamoist, maybe? I didn't like silicone glove. I'm going to tell you why I don't like silicone glove. 
And I'm a very honest Avon representative, okay? Silicone glove, when you put it on and you, you know, rub it in and stuff, it just has this weird kind of, uh, it feels really weird. So I guess it's supposed to be like a silicone glove. But it's supposed to also be a hand cream. So why do you want a hand cream that goes on like a glove and just comes off, peels off right away? You know, that's not what I want in a hand cream. And I don't know about everybody else, but that's not what I want in a hand cream. But, you know, everybody is different. Oh, let's see what else is nice here that's um, on sale. Stud earrings. Okay. I'm going to tell you another thing I don't really like about Avon because I'm a very <clears throat> honest representative. I don't really like the um, low end fashion jewelry, um, it's a little overpriced. I mean, I'm only being honest. It's a little overpriced, so I don't buy it. I do buy Avon jewelry. I just don't buy the low end price, the high priced low end. I want to say this uh, after um, after Black Friday. If you guys want to uh, join up on my mailing list. You can uh, click on my, uh, the website and then scroll down, and it'll say there. If you join my mail li mailing list, it'll give you ten dollars off your next order. Uh, if you order on my website, forty dollars or more, you get free shipping. Now, because of my health. And the way it is, I would rather have people order from my website and, you know, just pay for it with a credit card. Because, I mean, I know people have credit cards. Come on, wrong. Anybody who's getting any kind of money in, they have to have a credit card. I mean, come on. Um, I can also get books if you tell me you want a book. In fact, I have had some of my friends tell me that they would like books. So I will order books um, in this coming order that I'm gonna order. Um, that was all for the holiday? Are you kidding me? That was it for the holiday. Like there's hardly anything. Maybe there'll be more towards the holiday actually all right the what's new y'all notice how when i eat a cough drop my nose doesn't act up as bad that is so weird okay um Oh, okay, well, that was gifts under $10. Let's say gifts under $20, what it has for the holiday. All right, sort by, and if you press price, it'll give you this, the um, lowest price to the highest price. Avon Stories Perfume. Skip a beat. Avon Stories Skip a Beat is on sale for $9.99. Regular price is $17. That is a nice perfume because I gave out samples. I don't know if anybody got a sample or what. If you guys get to see this live, let me know if you want any samples at all. 
uh, you can let me know what kind of samples that you would like, or I can get you a list of what the samples are uh, before I order, and I will um, let you pick what kind of samples you would like for me to get for you. I do pay for the samples, and I give them free. So I think I'll put, mm, I think this is a very good deal. So I'm going to put this in the um, comments. Now, I'm not taking orders tonight. Like I said, I am not taking orders for Black Friday. If you feel the need to, <laughs> to go to my website and order for Black Friday, well, that's on you. But I am not pushing my Avon right now to sell for Black Friday. I'm not doing that. No, 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 no. I'm doing this because I have to make an order. When I make my order, I want to make sure if people are going to order or not, whether I'm going to order for people or so I can bring money in for more donations to go out, or if I'm just going to bring donations in to go out and it would help me so much if I could get orders from other people plus you guys will be shopping for your holiday you know and stuff like that for gifts so um you know uh I won't be selling anything on the holiday either on um Christmas or anything. Um, New Year's, I'm not going to be selling either. So uh, it's up to you guys. I mean, uh, an online order is better than anything for me. But if you want me to order you anything on this next order, because I only make an, one order, well, because I've been donating so much and I haven't been getting in much orders, like I said, I got one order this whole year. But why? Because I don't push the business all that much. Well, I've tried because I run the business to keep up donating. You know? I want to bring in money so I can donate it all out. I'm not making any money off of the business. That's what I got it for is to donate stuff out to help other people. So <clears throat> I don't know if y'all understand that or not. Okay. I want to bring in orders because I want to make money so I can donate more donations to where I donate to the people to help them, right? So I want to make money so I can donate the money into donating. I think that's what I want to say. I think people will get will understand me. So if you're here and you're watching the video, let me know, okay? Because uh, I gotta watch the comments. It's hard to watch them. Oh, hey! Hi, Sorry to yell. I get all excited. How are you, dear? Aww. Oh, well, happy Thanksgiving to you also. Thank you very much. Thank you very, very much. Yes, thank you so much. And you know what? I think for you, my beautiful dear, I haven't been sending people down to the Salvation Army, I don't think. And I don't know if I changed it in the group or not, but... Let me know if you're still working down there. Maybe I can uh, help some people out by sending them down there. So, and I'm always thinking, where am I going to send people in Youngstown to go get food? And you're always there. So, anyway, happy holiday to you, beautiful. Is this the group? What is this? Eh, add names, give some more.
Did I really share this on my page? I didn't know I shared this on my page. Okay, I don't remember things, but it's it's right there on my my ad names gives them more page. Well, that's funny. All right. I just got lost of what I was doing. <gasps> oh, did I put that in the comment yet? Yes, I know that in the comment. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm going to put this perfume there. There you go. Let me go see if it came out right. Oh, yeah. Oh man. Why? Why? Why does this always happen to me? <laughs> okay. Let me see if that went in the comments right. Maybe I shouldn't. Um... Because if I'm on the same page as the um, video, then I can't see. Okay. I'm go ah, there it is right there. Yay. Okay, so um, I think I, I put the, um, the link of the online brochure. So let me see here. Like I said, I'm going over like, does anybody want this? Um, Avon perfume let me know because if you don't want to order online after Black Friday then let me know because I'm probably going to order sometime next week I'm not sure when I'm going to put the order in but it'll be sometime next week so uh, let me give a date uh, what, what is the date today you know what? Let me check what is the date because I have to make that. Um, oh, announcement. I know I'm getting off topic, but I'm going to be here until 11, so it's 10, 13. Okay, so um, we have, uh, let me see where that, um, I have a, a lunch meeting with the ladies again. Um, wait a minute, what's going on here? Okay, let me see if I can remember this on my own because I can't find the message box. I have a lunch meeting with the ladies on December 5th at some Bob Evans restaurant somewhere over on High Street or something like that. Uh, on December 5th. So, uh, I was going to look up the date. Oh, my God, girl. It's the 28th today? All right, let me look at the calendar. Hello. So, <sighs> November 1st is Friday?
I mean, December 1st. Oh, God. <laughs> December 1st is Sunday. So what's the 29th? The 29th is Friday. So, okay, the 29th is Friday. The 30th is Saturday. Today is the 28th. Tomorrow is the 29th, which is Friday. I'm not doing Black Friday. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, let me know if you want any Avon on the next order going out. I'm definitely going to order on Saturday after Black Friday crap. Saturday. So, you guys got... All tonight and all tomorrow. So I would say by tomorrow night, by tomorrow night, let me know what you guys want to or want me to order. Um, now it has to be people out here in Columbus because because I'm out here in Columbus right now. Um, if I was going out to Youngstown, then I would say, okay, well, I'll cover um, Avon orders for Warren, Youngstown, Niles, and all those cities out there, you know, Boardman, Canfield, Austin Town, all of those. But unfortunately, if you guys can order online, that would be awesome. That would help me out with getting donations out before Christmas or whatever. So, um, or not even before Christmas, but it'll help me get donations out like before January, haha, <laughs> before the new year, before all of the winter rolls in. Okay, so, all right, I'm going to say something about the Avon slippers. Buy them at your own risk. If they are not what you wanted in a slipper, then send them back. As far as shoes, because I've never tried the slippers. As far as shoes and sandals, um, if you're a little on the big side, to be honest, I wouldn't buy shoes from Avon. I'm just an honest Avon seller. I have tried Avon shoes before and um, um, flip-flops and stuff like that before I got to 800 pounds. I used to be skinny. Um, then I got a little bit plump. And when I started getting a little bit plump, it started in 2005. Excuse me, when I started swelling up in my feet. So at that time, sometimes my feet wouldn't be swollen and sometimes they would be swollen. And when I was trying on the Avon shoes and sandals and stuff, they would break really, really easy on me. So after that, I decided I'm never going to buy anything, any shoes from Avon again, and I'm never going to sell them from Avon again. I mean, there's just some things in Avon that I will not buy and I will not sell. And I, you know, and I tell my customers, it's up to you what you want to buy off of Avon, off of my website, off of me, whatever you want to order it. But I do let all my customers know I'm 100% honest on all of the um, products that I have tried and that I do know about. So I won't, I won't take my risk in buying something that I know is probably not going to go right for me. Um, I don't really see anything else here.
that's on sale that I like or that somebody else would like. You know what? There's this dream color eye palette. I haven't seen this before. It's $15, but I think it would be worth $15. Seriously. So I'm going to put that in the, um, I'm going to put that link in the comments because I think this palette is worth $15. It is really nice and it looks like it's glittery. Oh my God. My sister is going to have a fit because she's going to be like, order me that. Oh, Stacy, I got something for you. You're going to be like, order that for me. And then I'm going to end up paying for it. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, so they do have the glitter. And let me tell you all something. If you all like this glitter eyeshadow, get it while you can. Buy as many as you can. I know they're... $15 if you buy two, they're $30. But I'm going to tell you what. If you got the money to spend and you love these, they're not going to last that long because women buy them up like crazy. And these will not, these will outlet so fast. You won't even know they were here. So get them while you can. I put the link in the comments. On the live video and I'll probably go and edit the uh, video when I'm done with all of the links and I'll also put it on the page oh my god here is another palette for $15 and it looks like it's just as sparkly oh my god y'all now I'm gonna get texts in on y'all all right this eyeshadow is glittery now, just remember, I'm not selling tonight. What I'm doing is I'm r trying to rack up orders for Saturday. If you live out here in Columbus and surrounding cities, like Columbus, Grove City, wherever you live out here in the vicinity of Columbus and surrounding, I travel everywhere. If I have to go and sell something, I will go. Okay. If um if I can't go, somebody else will go. <laughs> That's no problem. All right. <clears throat> so let's see. Oh my god, they got the glimmer shadows also. Oh man. My sister is gonna be like, buy me all of that. And I'm gonna be like, girl, I'm trying to get donation money up. Well, I can donate. All right, here's these. These are glittery. These are beautiful. Um, next, you know what? They have these skin so soft. Uh, skin so soft. Um, skin so soft sets again, and they're fifteen dollars. You know when I like to buy these sets is when they go into the outlet and they're like they go down to like $12.99 or $9.99 but they they're not guaranteed to go down to $12.99 but if you guys like sets the $15 sets are beautiful and they come with nice stuff in them oh my knee is hurting really bad oh <clears throat> Y'all, my knees are on bone, so that's why my knees hurt really bad all the time. They're bone on bone, so sorry about that. If I, if you see me like squinching in some pain or something, well, you'll know why. Cause they're bone on bone and they can be very, very painful. I have um, that arthritis that eats away at your whatever joints and stuff. And I think I've had it for very, like, since I was very young because um, I used to work a lot in gas stations and uh, uh, 
gas stations and in uh, uh, the restaurant, which was Jack in a Box in Houston, Texas. And um, where's my comments? Okay, if I don't see your comments now, I'll see them after the video. Um, just let me know you're there. You can message my page also. And what? Wait, what's wrong with my video? Nothing's wrong with my video. Is it still going? Okay. Wait, which one did I get the blue one, right? Hey, cutie. Uh-uh, you tagged me in a post. Hold on, let me go see it. <laughs> oh, God, it's going to be something funny. Aw, thank you. Aw, <laughs> did you eat the whole thing? <laughs> I bet you did. Well then, I guess when I get off here at eleven o'clock, I gotta go. I gotta go and prepare another fruit shop for you, huh? Oh my gosh! All right, um, next one. This is the purple, the winter. Oh my god, I love the winter lavender. And Seb, shout out to you. I don't know where you're at tonight, but I know you like this winter soft um, lavender stuff. Hmm. <laughs> Oh, God, don't tell me I'm getting a Charlie horse in my... Oh, have y'all ever had a Charlie horse? I got a Charlie horse in the back of my right leg. Oh, my God, it was hurting so bad. Oh, man. All right, let's see here. Um... All right, that was it for all I could find under 15 Was that under $15 or under $20? It was the stuff under $20. So now I'm going to go to the stuff under $30 and see what they have there. See, I like all the good stuff. Because I know what people like also. Oh, my God, look at this, y'all. Wild Country Cologne is on sale for eleven dollars. Yeah, yes, eleven dollars. So, guys, please pay attention to the comments. Um, so maybe you see what you like, and I can order it for you after Black Friday on Saturday. Um. Those, that stuff is just too expensive. Like, I don't know. You know what? There's like $20 trees. There's one for a haiku. There's one for passion. Perfume spray. Passion. Passion. Um, then you have two pretty perfect bubble bath. There's like two cats. There's one pink, one black. Each one is $20. And then you have the collectible uh, sports car decanter. That one is $20. But they're not sale items, so I really am not going to push that on my customers. If you guys want to see those, go into my 
click into my website, click on holiday, go down to where it says gifts under $30 and you will find those. Um, there's also a gift set, all eyes on me gift set, it's $22. It only comes with a bag. A bag, a mascara, an eyeliner, and a, one of the quads for $22. Then they have the Avon Crave Life is Sweet Lip Gloss set. I know a lot of people that like lip, lip gloss. I don't know if I would pay $20 for one, two, three, four, five of those. Three, six, nine. I mean, you're paying a little over, a little about four dollars maybe for each one of those. I, I wouldn't. All this stuff that's twenty dollars, I would wait until it comes out in the outlet. To be honest. Oh wow! I can't believe this. They have the Wild Country Holiday Kits, and they're so expensive this year. The Wild Country and the Black Suede. I wonder if they're going to come out with any different ones, because these are $22 each. It has a nice male man bag, a nice man bag, and then it comes with the perfume, the aftershave, and the shower gel. But I don't know. I'm not going to put that either. I mean, I like it, but. I think that you could probably get it cheaper. I wonder if they're only putting the, if the raised prices just because of it, the sales that are going on. That's so stupid. Okay, well, this true, true gent three piece set, I would pay $24 for that set. No joke. It's a nice price for that set. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in the comments. This is a men's cologne, and it's a pretty um, on the higher end of uh, colognes. So I'm going to go ahead and put that in the comments. For $24, I would buy that set, just to be honest. But these other ones for $22, just because it comes with a man bag, no way. No, no way. I'm not going to push stuff that I don't think that, you know. You know, I would do this polar bear. Like, I was trying to do um, unicorns and dinosaurs for um, Christmas. Unfortunately, nobody really wanted to order anything, so I ordered all that I was going to donate, and I donated them off. <laughs> and, um... I made no money off of any of those things. Okay. So, next up, we have Oh What Fun Makeup Mega Palette. The palette is $25. I would pay $25 for this palette. So, I'm going to put that in the comments. I would pay $25 for this palette. I seriously would. I think I would pay $25 for that. Next up is, I see another Palais um, collection. What time is it? I gotta watch my time. 10.34, so I got like 30 some minutes, right? All right, this Palais collection is also $25 and I would pay $25 for this collection. It's a nice collection. It comes with a lot of colors. So, yes, for all three of these, I think I would pay $25. I mean, I would even wait till they go into the outlet, but they're not going to go any lower than, like, they'll go lower than $25, but they're not going to go, like, like, way low, way low. All right, uh, next, let's see if I can find something else under 30 bucks. <clears throat> uh, oh, let's see here. I don't know why this perfume is twenty eight dollars. With oh, 
Oh, a singing snowman for $30. That is just so high. I don't know why these prices are so high. I really don't. But there is so much stuff on Avon that you can get so cheap and good quality, like women's perfume and men's perfume. That's not a freaking set. <sighs> Oh my god. All right, so let, let me go to fragrance gifts and see if they have anything cheaper than what they were offering in the, the other stuff. So, like I said, the Avon series Skip a Beat is on sale for $9.99. Wild Country Cologne is on sale for $10.99. Uh, let's see. Um, does anybody like candles? I'm going to tell y'all what. These candles are worth $19.99. I have bought a lot of candles from Avon, and they last for hours and hours, and they, they, they smell so good. Like, they light your place up with a whole bunch of smell, and it just smells so good. So they have a special offer. It says two for $25. And let me tell you something. How much is $25? Yeah, that's a good deal. So what I'm going to do is I am going to put these links in the, in the comments also. There's a rum cake, past the rum cake. I've never smelled it before. It's a new candle into Avon. So I'm put that in the comments. And remember, these candles are two for $25. Two for $25. Uh, the other one is Mocha Merry Mint Candle. Oh, my God. I'm thinking about buying these two candles just to smell them. You know, I have done that before, and I'm out of candles right now, so... <laughs> You know, I always spend Avon, I always order Avon for us and for to donate. I don't get many orders because I don't really push the Avon all that much. But then again, you got so many Avon representatives out there selling Avon. And it's like people are, I don't know, some people act like they're tired of Avon. But why would you be tired of Avon? Like me, the only deodorant that I can use. I can't even find it in stores anymore for me. Like, there's not one deodorant in any store that works on me. I have to go and buy it from Avon, and I, I can only use the Imari. I have no idea why either. I even get the shampoo cheap in Avon. So I don't buy shampoo at the stores anymore. I used to go to Walmart and buy my um, shampoo, which was the Suave um, 2-in-1. I don't even go and buy that anymore. Seriously. I don't. A very, very holiday. Oh, my gosh. I bet you this candle smells so good. So I'm going to put that over here huh? in the comments. They are two for $25. My eyes are getting really big on these candles, y'all. Seriously. Ha, ha, ha. All right, so I put this on price, so it's gone from small to big. So that was it for the candles, I guess. Mm -hmm. There was only three new candles, and I'm not pushing that stuff. $24 for that haiku set, it's not even worth it. The Velvet Holiday gift set for $30, that's not, mm -mm, heck no. I don't know why their prices are going so high this year. Wow, and that, anyway, I did do a bunch of, that stuff I'm putting there is like enough. Let's go check out the jewelry gifts. Like I said, I will not buy the low end um, of the jewelry of Avon. So let me go and see if I can find any pieces of Avon that I like that I can promote. 
Now, if you're just coming in to see the video and you want to know what I'm doing, I'm not taking orders tonight at all. Please do not go and order on my website unless you really, really, really want to order really bad for Black Friday. I don't do Black Friday. I don't promote on Black Friday. I don't do that kind of stuff. Well, you know what? Tonight's Thursday, so y'all can put an order in. Okay, well, anything y'all want to do, y'all can do tonight. Just not tomorrow because tomorrow is Black Friday. I don't do all that stuff. But anyway, um, it's for um, anybody who wants to order anything for me to order because I have to put my order in on Saturday. Yes, on Saturday. I'm putting my order in on Saturday. So if anybody out in the Columbus area would like to order, would like for me to order them something in my shipment, my shipment, then let me know. But if you feel better in ordering online, then you're welcome to order online also. Oh, my name. Yeah, I know I do take medication for that, but sometimes you just got to be in a little pain, I guess. <clears throat> oh my gosh. Um, let me get back into it. Um, it's hard. Okay. Um, and my face is probably turning all red because my blood pressure is going up. It shouldn't be going up. Should be okay. There's really no jewelry that I. Let me see here. Um, this sterling silver adorned CZ engagement set, it is cute. Regular price is $62.99. It's on sale for $34.99. And I'm going to be honest, I would buy that. I don't know about you guys, but this is the kind of jewelry that I buy from Avon. This right there. A little higher up on the end of the, you know, that's the kind of Avon I like. So let me go down here and see if there's any. I don't really like the sterling silver created sapphire. You know what? It's pretty though. I just don't think I would pay $34.99 for that one though. But like I said, if you guys want, okay, so if you guys want to see what I'm in, click on Click on any one of those things with the website, and then all you have to do is go up to the top where it says shop categories, holiday, what's new, how to's, about us, brochure, sales, and specials. Go to holiday and then click on the jewelry part, jewelry part, and it'll give you where I'm looking at. And the jewelry just keeps going up in price. And there's nothing, not even this red deco necklace. I don't know. Oh, it says join the wait list. So they don't even have that yet. They don't even have all this stuff yet. What is this? This is so pretty. And this is my sister's color. Oh my gosh, she would die for that. It's a pin. It's like a, a fashion pen, pen that like, oh my goodness, this, <laughs> it's like a fashion pen, but 
They don't have it yet. They're not even selling it. It says join the waiting list. Like, you know, I wish they wouldn't do that to my website. Put stuff on there that people can go and see, but they can't buy it. Please, y'all, I've had some customers tell me that they don't like that in the past. I understand that, but I've already taken it up with Avon, and they're just not cooperating. So, I mean, what can I do? You know, join the waiting list. You know, if you like it so much, just join the waiting list, and when they have it, they're selling it. Just buy it, you know? I mean, I'm sorry about that. It's like false advertisement. For me, I feel like it's false advertisement, and I hate doing that to my customers, but it's not me. It's Avon themselves, you know. Okay. Why is it not giving me... Okay, I'm going to go back up here. Okay, beauty gifts now. Let's go to beauty gifts because I've already gone to fragrance gifts. Mm -hmm. $49 for that? Well, you know what? Those things are pretty expensive. Yeah, so I would say 50 bucks for that is pretty good. Heard a good. Who does that? <laughs> That's embarrassing. That just came out, y'all. I don't know what that was. Who says that? Heard a good. Oh my god. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna forget what time it is, and I'll probably go past 11 to 11:30, which I don't mind. I'm having fun looking through all this Avon. Okay, I've already given the Palais. Ooh, they have a lot of nice stuff in here. Like, some of it's expensive. Dang. Well, I'm not going to put that set for $50 because I don't feel like it. Let's go see the holiday decor. See if there's anything in here. The holiday decor. Is anybody looking at my website with me at all? <laughs> okay. We have a three new candles. I guess that's ornament you know what there's nothing cheap here except for the um, candles on sale 2019 collectible plate with 14 karat gold accents it looks like a winter theme it's for 16.99 here's another oh, oh that's an ornament they got a light up bell jar with a reindeer scene for 24.99 25 bucks I bet you that thing is pretty big. You know, I'm going to tell you what. I have bought some things from Avon, and I don't know if y'all can see that one back there. I thought that lantern was going to be so small, and it turned out to be really big. And what else? Um, Some other things. Let's see. Uh, one year I bought a... Um, Oh, what do you call it? That little town that you stick under the Christmas tree or that you put on top of the fireplace or whatever. Um, I bought that one year and it was all light. <clears throat> it was all light up and stuff. And I can see that they have one right here. In fact, this is the one gingerbread house scene. I know they've, they've sold that before, but I'm going to tell you what it's worth $34.99 because it's going to be really cute. And it's not small like it looks in the picture. It's going to be a pretty big uh, house scene. You know, it's going to be really big. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't put it past this light-up jar to be pretty big. So I'm just going to add this in the comments, and I will put that. I will edit the video with that in the list 
So I'm going to go back here and I'm going to check out the 34. Now, I know these things are kind of expensive, right? But I'm going to tell you what, they're a lot better quality than what you're going to find at LTD Commodities or Walmart or anywhere else on the internet. Seriously, I don't know where they find this stuff from, but they are very high quality and these are stuff that I would just waste money on if I celebrated these types of holidays. So that was the gingerbread scene. Now let me go back to, oh my God, are you serious? They have a dashing light up dog. Okay. Ha. I've never seen a dashing light up dog. And then they, they have a growing light up gingerbread and they're both for $40. Now I'm gonna tell y'all what, these two things are probably pretty life size for $40, okay? Now, I'm not gonna put those in the comments, but I am gonna put the 2019 holiday village scene. It's an 11 piece village scene and it is for $40. And I tell you what, I've bought these before. They are absolutely beautiful. You can't go wrong with these. Like for under the tree or on top of the, excuse me, fireplace, or even if I celebrated Christmas or whatever, you know, it would look good up there, up there on my shelves, on top of my shelves. But I don't, sometimes I want to splurge and buy this expensive stuff just so people can see it on my decor, on my shelves, so they would, you know, really be like, hey, where did you get that from? That's from Avon? Are you kidding me? I've had people do that before. Yeah, you know what? The glowing light up gingerbread man. Are these for outside? They look like they're for outside. The gingerbread man has five stars. Oh my God, he goes outside. I'm sorry, I have to put him in the comments. He is $40, but he's like a giant type thing. And he goes outside and it has a picture there showing you how big he is. So he looks to be over a couple steps big. That's a nice, I don't know where they got these from. That's nice. If you guys want to check out the dog, then go in my website and click on holiday and then go down to holiday decor and you can put the price in there and it'll give you, um, or you can just not do the price and find it yourself. You can find the little doggy with the antlers on and then they have a singing snowman that's $30. I'm not putting that in. <laughs> if y'all want a snowman that sings for $30, well, that's that's your thing. Be my guest. Go ahead, you know. But I'm just trying to put um some whatever things in there that I feel like putting in there. So, okay, 10 bestsellers of what's new. That stuff is not new. Gift guide, blah, 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 newest A box. Never mind. All right, let's go shop the categories. Um, no, let's go shop the outlet. Ha, ha, ha. Let's go shop the outlet until... <laughs> All right, I'll give you guys with me until 11.30. How about that? And if anybody is there, please let me know you're there. You know what I'm saying? So I can, like... 
hello, shout you out. All right, so it's 10.55. I would say I'll go until 11.30, maybe. Okay, here's something that I would probably buy and try out. Now, I did say that I will not buy any sandals or shoes from Avon. These are boots, and they are $24.99. And I tell you what, they're cushion walks, they're fox patents. These, I would say buy them, try them out. If they don't work out for you, then send them back. But if I could, I would buy these boots. But they don't have my size. Aha. Uh, they have up to nine medium, so wait a minute, wait a minute, is that right? Yes, up to nine medium, they don't have my size. These are, yeah, it has women on it. Girl, they got a plus size lady on here with these boots on. Now, you know what plus size woman is going to wear a size nine medium. Her boots have got to be bigger than size 9 medium, okay? Because her legs are a little bit fat, to be honest. Come on now. Be realistic. They're not realistic in their pictures either, let me tell y'all. They are not being realistic in their pictures, y'all. That's not right. I don't think that's right. Uh, what can I say? All right, three ninety nine for that. You know what? They got the little uh little star decanters. You know they're pretty small, but they are a nice size for three ninety nine. They're worth it because usually they're going for like seven ninety nine here. So I'm going to put down here, this $3.99, 4 bucks for this little star, and it's far away. It's worth the $4, believe me. It is worth the Okay. Yeah, that's because. <laughs> I look funny. Okay, I got to doing something else, so <laughs> let me just fix this right quick. <laughs> All right, me and this chick used to be friends. I don't know what happened. Oh, I lost my other account. That's why. All right, so we got the star. Is there any more? St oh, wait a minute. Here's more boots. Isn't that the same boot? Wait a minute. Oh, okay. Yeah, it looks like it. Are you oh, 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 yeah. These are going to be the same stuff. Palm sheet candle, $7.99. $6.99. Guys, I'm not going to make it till 11.30. I don't think so. I need to go to the bathroom.
So I'm going to have to cut this video short. And I will do another one on Saturday, hopefully. Oh, man, guys, go check out the outlet. <laughs> mm, it's got some nice stuff. But guess what? I ain't got to go. What time is it? I made it to 11. Man, I timed my body really good, didn't I? All right, Retro Revival Sweepstakes. Let me put that in the bottom right quick. I want y'all to all go sign up for this sweepstake. Because you never know if you're going to win or not. It's so pretty. Look at it. Oh, my God. I would love to win something like that. It's so pretty. So please sign up for my sweepstakes. Remember, $40 or more, you can get free shipping. And if you're signing up with your email and you're going to order from me for the first time, What was I saying? If you're signing up with your email on my website and you're going to order for the first time, you're going to get 10% off of your order plus free shipping if your order is $40 or more. So figure that out. That would be awesome sale right there. Okay. So um, I've already gone over donating. I've already gone over my Kendra's page. I've already gone over the scammer group. And the last thing that was on my mind was the Avon. And I don't know if you guys have been commenting or not. I'm going to have to check the page for comments or the video for comments later. But hopefully you guys are going to let me know what I need to order on this next shipment. Because if nobody makes any orders for me, then I just have to order some donations and probably some nice special Avon for me. Or something will sell or whatever. And then, I don't know, because the buy-sell trade groups are really not letting me sell my Avon even if I have my Avon on hand. Which I think is pretty grimy. Because the candles are really, really nice. And I see people from all of the other um, companies like Pink Zebra and stuff like that selling their on-hand stuff. So I don't know why people hate Avon so much. I mean, I hate a lot about Avon, but I don't hate Avon. Like, I have a love-hate relationship. <laughs> I always have, since I was 15 years old and they let me sell Avon, I've always had a love-hate relationship with them because a lot of times they will uh, bring in stuff and me and my customers will get so used to them and then all of a sudden they will outlet them out and discontinue them. <laughs> it makes me so furious. Like, <laughs> It makes me furious. It gets me upset. You know what I'm saying? It's like, man, are you serious? I just lost a customer. Y'all doing that to me, really? You know? So that's the way I feel. But um, also, if you if you want to sign up to sell Avon, there's three kits. Um, I think it's 25 35 No. $30. $50 and $100. Can't believe it's $30 to sign up for everyone. <laughs> Wait a minute, let me check that right quick before I tell the wrong information. Oh my god, let's go down here and see. All right. Sell so Avon. Let's see. Mm. 
No. Oh, come on, huh? Really? Come on. Okay, guys, you know what? What I want y'all to do is like, um, <laughs> let me go back to my website. Okay. I'm going to put my the main link to my Avon the Avon page. Click on that, go all the way down on your right. You're going to look over and it says sell Avon. Click on sell Avon and see what it says. There's three kits, or did they change the one? Look, they are changing all the time. I have no idea what they're doing right now. <laughs> and I'm going to tell you why, too. Because my uplines kind of treated one of my uplines really bad just because he wasn't selling enough Avon. And they really, really, like, down him in front of me. And I was like, wait a minute, I'm busting my butt all the time to try to sell Avon, and I'm making good money, right? But it's benefiting these chicks that's just taking it out on my upline, talking about he don't sell enough. Guess what? It's not always about you. So I settled down and I started running my business the way I felt like I wanted to run my business. Are they making money off of me very much? Not anymore. So like I said, I don't look to make it rich in Avon ever. No. I do it. I stay in Avon to help people because it has been the only company that I have ever been in off and on since I was 15 years old when they let me get in after I had, um, you know, got legally married and stuff like that. They were like, well, if you're legally married already, we'll, we'll let you sell Avon because, you know, you're already emancipated, blah, blah, blah. That was done in Houston, Texas. So, you know, I've been uh, doing Avon off and on since 15 years old. And like I said, I have a, a love-hate relationship with it. But I do know how to, you know, manipulate Avon into my way and nobody else's way. And like I said, if you would like to sell Avon and you want to sign up under me, um... I don't stay with the upline. I'm not going to be on your butt every day to sell, sell, sell. You got to sell this much. You got to sell that much. You got to have this order in by this date. You got to hurry up and do this. No. You join Avon because it's supposed to be your business. You work your business how you want to work your business. Ain't nobody can tell you how to run your business. If I never want to make money off of Avon, I'm never going to make money off of Avon, right? If I want to make money off of, off of my orders to do donations for people and help people out, that's what I'll do. I'll push my Avon, I'll make orders, and I'll help people out. And if I just don't make any orders at all, nobody wants to order from me, and I just got to keep donating myself, well, guess what? God blesses me anyway. So let me know what 
you may want me to order on my order coming up that's going to come straight to my home that if you order i will have to go and deliver it to you or you can pick up or we can meet somewhere or whatever out here in columbus and surrounding areas whatever sometimes yes my health is not that good and i have to plan like a week in advance before i can go drop something off or whatever and also like i said that lunch is coming up a bunch of us women get it's an empowerment group for women but you know we don't discriminate against no man if a man wants to show up at the lunch he's gonna show up girl we don't discriminate against nobody let me tell you we are all for one and one for all so you know like i always say god gave us free will we can do whatever we want whatever we please to our discretion to his discretion whatever you know whatever feels better for us so if there's anybody out there and if there's any questions you can um you know just leave a comment i can't really see the comments right now <laughs> sorry about that but please please check out my kendra's journey page um i'm also gonna do a a live video soon on another little girl that i like and she is oh two actually two i have a friend lisa and she's a grandmother to a nice little girl who has had to have many surgeries since she was born and then my cousin also i want to make a live video for her gofundme um now my cousin i will support this gofundme that she put because i was waiting for her to put up a gofundme but she wouldn't do it herself now my cousin deserves this because i'm gonna tell you what she does help other people when i had chest pains so bad that i couldn't drive i couldn't even walk she drove all the way out here to columbus with my sister to take me back to youngstown so i could go and get myself admitted into the hospital where my doctor is and stay out there for i think i ended up staying out there for a long time I'm not coming back for a while but she was scared to drive but she did it she came out here and she drove me all the way back and there's so many time, other times when she has helped me so i'll do anything for her oh god my cousin donna i'll do anything for her so uh i took her stuff out there and i wasn't able to stop at the akron hospital shout out to you donna i'm really sorry i didn't get to you but uh stacy still has your stuff i hope she's gonna be able to get that to you soon to you and the baby but um, yeah, uh, next live. You see, I need to write things down before I do a live. Plus, I only had until 11 o'clock tonight, and I wanted to cover my Kendra journey page, my Kendra's PayPal, my scammer group, and my Avon. Because I need to push some Avon so I can get some revenue in, so I can push out some donations. Other than me just trying to <laughs> donate everything all the time like i have nothing nothing i have donated almost everything like yes i have the bookcases and stuff back here but that's just to hold my stuff like food and um medication that i need you know but I'm talking about other stuff, like stuff that I get from Avon and stuff that I get from other places. I mean, I don't know what is wrong with me. I'm a hoarder, but I'm not a bad hoarder, like not one of them extreme hoarders. <laughs> like I'll get something, I'll hoard it for like one week, and then I'm like, oh man, I got to go donate this somewhere. <laughs> okay, that was fun. So I gotta go, guys.
Bye. And um, please remember, let me know if y'all want to order anything before Saturday because seriously, I have to put this order in. I have to put this order in and I want to know whether I have to do just donations or if I can do donations and orders or if I can do all orders and then do another order after that for donations. You know what I'm saying? If I have something coming in, then I can put more out and that would be awesome. Like a hundred, like up to a hundred deodorants, that's just not enough for me. I can, I feel like I can do more than that. If I'm selling Avon to people, if people are ordering from me, then I can do a hundred deodorants for myself. But how about do a hundred more from the revenue that comes in from some Avon orders, right? That would be awesome. Oh, and socks. Socks maybe before January and February? I'm just asking for some help. It would be awesome to get some orders so I can donate more. I really want to donate more. I love donating. God, last year was such a good year for us. Like, I had so many donations go out. I had, I don't know, Lisa, you would have to tell me, was it like 100, dona uh, 100 de deodorants going out last year? with a whole bunch of socks. She had never gotten sock donations from anybody before. She was the only one pushing the socks out. And then I sent her a whole bunch of socks and she was like, oh my God, nobody's ever donated this many socks to me to give to the homeless before. And I was like, okay, okay, you know? So I don't know, I just need orders so I can get these socks and everything. And instead of doing the socks for the homeless, I did for, my kindred's journey, which I have no regrets at all because I need her to get that surgery. I need her to live. I do not want that little girl to die. Okay, I don't want to cry. So I don't want that little girl to die. So I uh, also um, donated to her thing. So um, yeah, so I'm just trying to get some orders for the Ava. I gotta go. Okay, bye y'all. Bye bye. Aloha, fees. Bye. Ended. <laughs>